Welcome back, everyone. It's Trivia Tuesday. Nathan and Holly in the Cerebral Thunderdome. Are you ready to go today? Hope so. Oh, I guess. not a lot of <laughs> enthusiasm there. Okay, <laughs> let's start out with a little pop culture. Where were the Lord of the Rings movies filmed? Were they filmed in Ireland, Iceland, New Zealand, or Australia? Lord of the Rings movies were filmed Very in this good beautiful country. Iceland, <laughs> Ireland, New Zealand, or Australia? Ready? New Zealand? New Zealand. Ireland. It is New Zealand. Good job. Yeah. Very beautiful there. Okay. Anything out first. Which president was the first known U.S. speleologist, which is a cave explorer? The first president to do this. He was a cave explorer. Was it James Madison, Thomas Jefferson, Ronald Reagan, or Donald Trump? One of those was a speleologist. James Madison, Thomas Jefferson, Ronald Reagan, or Donald Trump? The first cave exploring That's president. That's quite the spectrum of presidents. Right. There. That's a good range of presidents there. Thomas Jefferson? Madison. It's Jefferson. Yeah. Nathan's Jefferson was kind of a. He, was a, he, he did He's a lot very of. Very weird yeah. dude. He was all over. <laughs> Let's do another pop culture. Which actor was in the following movies The Outsiders, Wayne's World, and Tommy Boy? So this actor was in all three of those movies. Was it Rob Lowe, Matt Dillon, Tom Cruise, or C. Thomas Howell? Basically, Brat Packers. Yeah. Which actor was in the following movies? The Outsiders, Wayne's World, and Tommy Boy. Was it Rob Lowe, who never ages, Matt Dillon, Tom Cruise, or C. Thomas Howell? <laughs> I'm guessing. I'm this guessing is our era, Holly. Rob Lowe. Rob Lowe. It is Rob Lowe. Good, <laughs> Good job, guys. They know the Rob Lowe movies. Good I job. I wish I could age like him. Oh, I know. Yeah, he's held up pretty well. What 1960s rock song begins with the line, Get your motor running? Is it Dead Man's Curve? Is it 409? Pink Cadillac, or Born to be Wild. What well, 1960s song begins with the line, get your motor running. They say it much cooler than I just did. Dead Man's Curve, 409, Pink Cadillac, or Born to be Wild. Holly, I thought you would jump on this. Nathan has his already. I don't like my guess here. <laughs> <laughs> you I'm didn't guessing. say it right because I couldn't. Do you want me to well. sing it? Would yes, I no. want you to sing it. No. I the audience does not need to be I did Pink Cadillac, too. It is Born to be Wild. Oh. Steppenwolf. Yeah, Born to be Wild. Yeah, there you go. Gosh. What company, See, I would have done it if you... If I'd have yeah, really exactly. got into it. I was going to bring my guitar and really go. <laughs> what company uses the slogan, Life's Messy, Clean It Up? Is it Bounty, Clorox, Bissell, or Swiffer? This company uses the slogan, life is messy, clean it up. Bounty, Clorox. Right now it does, or is this an old slogan? Uh, I think it currently uses this slogan. What company uses the slogan, life's messy, clean it up? Bounty, Clorox, Bissell, or Swiffer? I don't know. I think you've ruled out one because you immediately think of their slogan. Right, that's what I think. I did you Swiffer. Went Clorox and Swiffer. It is Bissell, the vacuum cleaner. I don't have that yeah. kind, so. <laughs> what candy has a slogan of Taste the Rainbow? Oh. There will not be any options on this one. Taste the Rainbow. I can't get ahead because I'm sure Nathan knows this. Skittles. Skittles. It is yeah. Skittles. We all like our <laughs> Skittles. That's true. What legendary comedian was known for his tagline, I don't get no respect? Was it George Carlin, Eddie Murphy, Jack Benny, or Rodney Dangerfield? Both were already writing. <laughs> I don't get no respect. George Carlin, Eddie Murphy. Eddie Murphy. Eddie Murphy, it is Dangerfield. Three to two. Okay. Oh, Holly up. can I'm tie it up on this. <laughs> Who painted the Mona Lisa? Was it Pablo Picasso? Was it Leonardo da Vinci? Jackson Pollock or Grandma Moses? <laughs> painted the Mona Lisa. Pablo Picasso, da Vinci, Pollock or Grandma Moses? Holly desperately trying to tie things up. <laughs> Da Vinci? It is Da Vinci. It is Da Vinci. Okay. So. Tiebreaker. Tiebreaker. Uh, is there? Well, you're down by one still. Oh, I am. Yeah. Oh, no, so, <laughs> Nathan will win the trophy this time. Congrats, he will Nathan. take it home. It will be locked up. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. We'll be back after this. <laughs>